This video will serve as an introduction to the gut-brain connection. The gut-brain axis is a dynamic network that connects our central nervous system to the intricate world of our digestive system. So in this highway of communication between our brains and our guts, this network involves nerves, hormones, and our gut microbiota. Microbiota is defined as a range of microorganisms that live inside of you. For the purpose of this video, we're going to focus on your gut microbiota and understand the role that they play in this gut-brain connection. So this gut-brain connection implies that your emotions and thoughts are intricately linked with the functions of your digestive system. And feel free to pause this video and reflect on the times of the past when your stress directly led to digestive discomfort, especially after a meal or after having an argument at the dinner table. This stress not only messes with your mood, but can also shake up your gut microbiota composition. So when stress kicks in, what happens is that your autonomic nervous system and pain pathways go into action. The autonomic nervous system in particular influences things like gastrointestinal mucus secretion. So the more stressful that you feel in your daily life, the less mucus your gut produces. Now, you might think of mucus as just like dirty snot from your nose, but this mucus is actually crucial for our digestive purposes because they protect our gut walls and linings and make your gut environment hospitable for the good gut bacteria, also known as probiotics. But here's the twist. Your gut microorganisms can also play a role in controlling your mood-related behaviors. So this is like a dance between your emotions and your gut. And just as important it is to communicate while you're dancing in real life, gut microbes also communicate using their secret language. The communication of our gut bacteria happens through quorum sensing, which is a chemical signaling system. But that's not all. They can also sense signals from our gut epithelial cells and special immune cells. These cells release a whole bunch of signaling molecules like cytokines, serotonin. And the release of these molecules is influenced by the central nervous system. So inside of our gut, we have this massive symphony going on where the central nervous system is releasing a whole bunch of signaling molecules and these molecules engage in a conversation with one another as well as with the gut microbes that pick up their messages through their quorum sensing. Like I said, this is a very special ecosystem we have going on inside of our digestive tract. And if this is your first time hearing about this gut brain connection, drop a like, leave a comment below and subscribe to our channel so that you get notified of more gut health content like this. So let's keep going. Ideally, you want the symphony to be sounding beautiful and in harmony. But what happens when stress hits? What happens to the communication there? Suddenly, your intestinal walls can become a bit more permeable. So this phenomenon is known as leaky gut. Like I said before, stressors influence the autonomic nervous system to decrease the secretion of the gastrointestinal mucus. Because there's less mucus, the food particles, bacteria, as well as toxins inside of your gut can actually leak out into the bloodstream. And what happens when these foreign particles are floating through your blood? Well, your body senses it and triggers immune response which shows up as rash on your skin, hives, breakouts, skin inflammation, and other autoimmune conditions. If your gut was not leaking, this immune response would be totally unnecessary. But this is a complex interplay of genetics and environment, and the result is systemic inflammation, impaired immune system, and disruptions in mood. This all sounds terrible, but now that you understand the mechanism of the gut-brain connection, you hold the key to maintaining a healthy balance inside of your body. So let's connect the dots between mood and inflammation. When you're feeling down, this often comes with an increase in pro-inflammatory cytokines. And here's the kicker. This is linked to changes in neurotransmitter metabolism, which can activate the stress response. And the gut's permeability plays a crucial role in this change. This means leaky gut can potentially activate the stress response and trigger inflammatory chemicals to be released. So it goes both ways, either your emotions causing the stress that's disrupting the gut or already weakened gut can signal nervous response that activates stress response and causes you to feel that emotional distress. 
But here's where serotonin can really come in and flip the script because 95% of serotonin is produced in the gut. And this hormone is actually known as the happiness hormone or feeling good hormone. This is a key player in both the central nervous system and in your digestive system. So the changes in the gut microbiome can profoundly influence serotonin release. So by flourishing your gut environment with probiotics, you are essentially allowing yourself to release more serotonin, which plays a role in regulating your mood thereby supporting your emotional well-being as well as your gut health. And when you're choosing probiotic supplements to boost your gut health, make sure that you choose one with various strains of beneficial bacteria and that the total number of colony forming units is substantial. In addition, your probiotic supplement should contain both probiotics and prebiotics together because prebiotic serves as a food source for your probiotics so they can populate your gut in abundance. In addition, make sure that the probiotics can reach the intestines safely without being broken down by your stomach acid and bile. And finally, your probiotic formula must have been produced and stored in safe conditions to prevent spoilage. Wondering which probiotic supplement meets these four conditions? Check out what we have at our Premium Pro Nutraceutical store. We have a variety of probiotics that you can choose from, but the one that I'll recommend you today is the 100 billion probiotics. It's got 100 billion viable cells of probiotics that will reach your intestines without being destroyed by the stomach acid. In addition to the prebiotic blend that's included to support the probiotics abundance in your gut. It has 12 different strains of probiotics that will support and nurture your healthy gut and your mind. So go ahead and get yours today. The link to purchasing this product will be in the description and in the comments below. As always, thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.